I'm going to do something really weird. I'm going to plant a thought in your mind and then I'm going to steal it away. Let me show you what I mean. We're going to use my watch for this. And as we all know, when you pull out the pin on the watch, spin it around, it changes the time on the watch. So Esma, that's exactly what you're going to do. Pinch your fingers like this and you can go forwards or backwards, but spin the pin around and stop whenever you like. I'll look away. Okay, you can push it in if you like. Fantastic, that's locked that time in. So you can remember the time for me. Okay, you have it, and Sarah, you can see it too. Yep. And now Sarah, hold out your hand for me and place your other hand on top of the watch so I can't get to it. So I said I would steal your thoughts and I'm gonna try and steal the, the time that you're thinking of. So here we go. Just think of it for me. Doing a great job, thank you. Oh, this is actually really easy because there are two numbers the same in this time, right? Yeah, it's five minutes past five, is that correct? Yes. But this is where it gets weirder, because I said I would also plant a thought in your mind. And I did, because you thought of the time five minutes past five, but that's not possible. You see, the watch that you've been holding on to the whole time, the watch that you checked out the time from, actually doesn't have five minutes past five on it. You see, it's completely blank, it has no hands. There is no way you could have picked the time five minutes past five.